Hey guys, this is Eshix, and I just want to show you guys a real good spot here to make some uh, pretty easy gold here. Um, we're going to be doing some transmog farming, so if you're the kind of person who doesn't really want to wait around for sales and stuff to sell in the auction house, probably isn't the guide for you. And as everybody knows, you know, transmog takes a while to sell. It's not always going to be you know the same day and all that, so just keep that in mind. But anyways, we're here in Thousand Needles in the very bottom right-hand corner of the map, a place called South Sea Holdfast. Um, so pretty much what we're going to be doing is running through this cave here that's on the ridge, killing these guys called Den Whompers. Um, they're level 40 to 42 elite mobs, and they drop tons of good gear for transmog sales. Uh, specifically, they drop saltstone gear, which is, you know, obviously going to make you tons of gold. So in my trade skill master here under my accounting tab, um, a couple months ago I did a run here for a few minutes, and uh, within the first 10 minutes I got a drop here for saltstone leg plates of the whale. And those sold for just under 2,200 gold on the auction house. So that's obviously, you know, pretty good profits for only 10-15 minutes worth of work. Um, to keep in mind, you're not always going to get salt stone gear, but there is, I think, like six or seven pieces that drop. So if you add those together, the drop chances aren't that bad at all. Um, I say if you spend probably an hour here, you're going to get a piece. Most of them sell us for at least over four or five hundred gold. Uh, in this case, to 2,200 gold. So anyways, we're going to do a run here. I'm going to go for 20 minutes, see what I can uh, come up with. Uh, so pretty much just run through the cave, kill everything, loot everything, and then we'll, uh, we'll see how much gold we can make. So I'm going to start it now, 20 minute timer, and I'll be back. Alrighty, so that wraps up the 20 minute run, and I'll show you guys what we got. So the top portion here is just pretty much junk. Uh, the greens I'm going to disenchant, the grays I'm probably just going to vendor. Um, so just take my word for it, the stuff isn't worth much at all. Anyways, moving on. Uh, between silk and mage weave cloth here, we got about 300 gold um, worth of cloth. That's pretty solid for about 20 minutes worth of work. Then we head over to the transmog items. Now keep in mind guys, the prices are going to be different for every server, so don't expect to get exact results as what I've got. And keep in mind, this spot is like 300% luck. I mean, you can go in there one day, farm for 10 minutes, make 10,000 gold. Go in there another day, farm for an hour and a half, make, you know, 1500 I mean it's totally all, all over the map um, so if you get a lucky run good for you if you get unlucky better luck next time anyways we'll start with the transmog items here um, first item you got wolf riders belt of the monkey the market value on that is about 1180 gold so that's pretty solid item there that'll sell pretty quick moving on we got the Hawkeyes tunic uh, leather piece it's about 300 gold honestly I don't really like dealing with the the low value items I'd probably just sell this off for about 150 to 200 gold just to try to get rid of it. Uh, definitely undercut any competition on that one um, just to get it out of my inventory. Next piece, Warden's Wristbands. Um, it's about 300 gold. Honestly, these wrist plates or the bracers, whatever you want to call them, they're worth pretty much nothing. Um, I'd probably just ditch this for about 50 to 65 gold. Um, the bracers, they don't sell very well for transmog because most of the armor sets you can't see bracers anyways. So there's not really, you know, a market for this kind of stuff. So either disenchant it or sell it for real cheap to get it out of your inventory. Anyways, moving on. Uh, sparkle shell, shoulder pads of the wolf. That's about 700 gold item there. So that's a pretty nice piece. Uh, that was one of the first items that dropped for me. So I was pretty excited. Uh, moving on. Oh, here we go. This is the item you guys want. Um, so if you guys see the word saltstone on any of your armor, you better have a fucking party because check this out. Saltstone Gauntlets of Strength, 2,600 gold. <laughs> 2,600 gold. My god. In 20 minutes. Even if we just had this one item in 20 minutes, I'd be happy. That's totally good profits. This will sell within 2-3 to three days, no problem. So if you guys see Saltstone, just start celebrating. Anyways, moving on here. Steadfast Gloves of the Bear, 1,700 gold. And also another nice item. This will sell pretty quick. I've sold a couple of these in my time as well, and uh, definitely they sell pretty fast, uh, pretty high demand. Uh, next, we got saltstone arm splits of the bear. Now, these these are bracers saltstone, so they're worth nothing. Keep that in mind. So, you know, I saw saltstone, I freaked out, noticed they were the bracers, and then I cried. Uh, these are worth pretty much nothing, about 50 gold. If you want to try to ditch them for that, I'd probably just disenchant them, to be honest. It's worth about 30 gold disenchant value. So I'll just end up doing that. Uh, moving on, last piece we got was Symbolic Gauntlets. This is about a 550 gold item. Pretty solid piece here, and uh, should have no problem selling those at all. Nice plate piece. Uh, nice green tinge to them there. So overall, guys, we got a pretty good run here. I got pretty lucky. 
uh, surprisingly. And like I said, this is only 20 minutes. We got all this stuff. So taking a look at the stuff here, what do we got? Like, let's say six, seven thousand gold worth. Like that's pretty amazing considering you know 20 minutes of work, seven thousand gold. Can't complain about that. So anyways, you guys go give this a try. Um, like I said, keep in mind the stuff won't sell right away, so just be patient with it, and you'll be rolling in the cash. Anyways, um, go ahead and drop a comment if this guide helped you guys out, and uh, that's pretty much it, guys, so take it easy, and uh, peace.